What's going on guys? Ben here and we are doing episode 4 of our Under the Waves Let's Play. We've just woken up day 15 and this alarm's going on. I'll leave a little link up above and this playlist below as well in the description for um, you to catch up if you're just coming to this one and you haven't seen the previous episodes. But otherwise we're going to continue. Remember to please, please like, comment and subscribe. Let's jump straight in and see what's going on here. Um, so we've just woken up. Alarm's going off. Guess we're gonna want to see what's. Okay. Stay calm. You're not drowning. What's going on? There's no leak. Call Tim. He'll. He'll know what to do. Guess it's not saying what's wrong. Are you? Ah, does nothing work in this bloody place? All right. All right. What was the... In the training we had? Uh, the fuses. Power issues stem from the fuses. Has to be that bloody storm again. Merc? Mercury? Hmm. Nope. Fat love help you, huh? He's gone as well. Dead. Okay, just like in training, get your diffuse box, poke around a bit, bring this tub back to life. Uh, where'd the fuse box be? Outside? I guess, yeah, I guess it's outside. I would presume the fuse boxes would be inside, right? Where they're less likely to get wet. You know? To find the fuses. At least you can still get in and out. Um, where would the. Oh, there's the fuse box. What are we looking at? Looks like it's cut off from the mains. First job reconnection. Wait, what do we what do we want to do? Did that solve it? Or do we just take a battery out? Oh no, there we go. Okay. Oh good. Okay. Finally. Jesus Christ. Oh, he's fixed it at least. Bit of an alarm, isn't it? Bit of a wake up call. Yeah, it does seem like it's falling apart. Uh, peace. Stan Murray calling HQ. Come in, Tim. Tim. You there? Stan, how did you... Thought you were offline. Never mind. Look, no time for chit-chat. What's happening? This storm, it's, uh... It's worse than anyone thought. Something broke loose, sir. Uh, long story short, there's a fire up here that's stubbornly refusing to go out. Is it... Are you... Are you okay? Yeah, well, no. Not really. Maybe... Maybe you can help. Tell me. There are fail safes for this situation. Drones are sent. Drilling is pulled offline. Across the old sea dogs don't have to worry about possibly being evacuated. But the remote deactivation for the drills is back in the control center, which is now completely off limits due to the severe risk of burning to death in an oil fueled fire. This is officially unofficial, but I need you to head to the main drill site, Sector A. Get those things offline manually. Stop them sending the crew up the line. Send me the location. Done. Yeah, we can do that. I'm going to try to get the drones on site, but hell, those things are unreliable at the best of times. Okay, okay, yes. Back in Dustan. We're being moved again. Stay safe, old man. Okay. Yeah, we can do this. You need trench. We keep the planet moving. 
okay so yeah by the time you're watching this the fourth episode you've probably seen episodes one two and three and i filmed those um Lights near enough green. back to back and then i've got to wait till i edit them you know, let youtube process them and everything and so yeah it wasn't until i was I putting the description and all the bits in and I'll everything hear. like that good oh. This is the Still third emergency good. rally point this morning. Tim, are we? Is this on us? Is that? Look at this. Look what we've done here. This is too much, Tim. I can't. This is too, too much. Hey, no. None of that. This isn't on you. This is the company. It's always been the company. But what's a company? Tim. Oh, it's all the oil. It's people. You and me. We just rolled over. Let them in without even so much as a fight. That spilled all the oil you know everywhere. It. Your dad and me and the rest of us. We fought. We fought hard. The meetings, the protests. I was there for the lot. And now we're here together. My bloody turncoats. We fought and we lost. The inner trench was always going to take over these waters, but there were those of us who thought we could limit the damage from the inside. And you, you're here because you're lost, Stan. Have been ever since Pearl. I... It's okay. It is. I wanted to help you know. Anyway, I could. And now there's this damn mess. Hmm. Yeah, so I was very much, um... What? I'm trying to. I tried to get the things to leave their bunker, but they're stuck. You mean those jams? They won't activate. Money. Without those, the rig, all of Sector B, it's a goner. What can I do? Jesus, Dan. You're enough on your own plate. Sector A remains the priority, but if you can pay a visit to the drone control center, fix that door. If you can get them moving, I'd. Uh, I can try. I have to go. All hands crisis meet. Good luck, Stan. Don't do anything stupid. I mean it. Okay, we've got a few few missions here to do then. Um But yeah, so basically as I was trying to say, it's always like narrative going on. Um I was not aware <laughs> this was set in the seventies. And it clearly says that on the Steam page. I just don't That's don't it. read the descriptions. <laughs> so the previous episodes of me going, hmm, when is this set? It's an alternate reality in the 70s. Okay, so we can laser the things, but we can't pick them up. Um, still need to find a whale shark as well. Central drone control. All the way over there. So much oil everywhere now. Like all over the place. Is that new though? Is that a new... Like, hang on. There's, there's a little box there we can get. Keep your eyes out, eyes peeled for a whale shark. What's a little bit more oil in the water at this point? It's probably it there where the red light is. Oh no, it's kind of a different direction. Oh, it's up there. Up on the 
Balancing Act. Okay. Just just in case. I don't think these are whale sharks, but oh, that's a nice one. No, I know, but there we go. Things up. Careful with this. Get in Where's here. Where's this from? As well. Music box. Oh. This must be the one Tim mentioned. Okay. Whew. Quite the crash. It's kind of just like blending in the ecosystem now, isn't it? Where's my, uh, there he is. Off we go. See what it's like up on the surface. Yeah, we can see the fire. Are they offshore or do you think they're like up in the little there's little towers. Oh. Excuse me. Right. Music's too relaxing in this game. And the water sounds. I'm someone who like, like has like rain sounds and ocean sounds to go to sleep. <laughs> and so this kind of stuff. Is what? Oh, there's a bit of stormy in there. Yeah. Waves look really nice though. Lighthouse never works. Yeah, it's pretty cool, isn't it? All right. Back to work. Right. So there's quite a few. I'm going to go grab the sticker. I still don't know where that crafting blueprint is. We're going to try and find this once and for all. It's kind of bothering me, you know? I go to bed at night wondering where it is. <laughs> um, I can only imagine there's a cave. Make sure the X is placed on it. I mean, yeah, it's placing the X on it there, it says it's like on top of it. We know that's not the case. Like, we know that. We know it's not there. Tim's burning. 
Or not burning, hopefully. We'll have a little look. Don't think there's any kind of cave system going on here. Not that's nearby the eye. So we've got one, we've got another crafting blueprint there. I feel like this one should be pretty, pretty straightforward. Or should be. Was it in the menu that we could see? Got all of that. So we're missing four, five, six, seven, seven apparently. A few upgrades. Even with these, the, the lines don't go under. Maybe it's a bug? This is no... I don't think it's inside either, is it? Crafting blueprint. I've pretty much interacted with everything. Get this one. Some plastic as well. Replenish the stock. Um, sticky. Lime fizz. Huh. Some sticks to get. Got that one. I oh, can actually equip the sticker. Oh, that's cool. Enjoy the view. Is it? Can we only? Can we only attach one sticker at a time? I don't know. You can attach them all. Yeah. Oh, you can see them on the on the um. Like the what's it called? Scuba tank. Okay. God knows what it's doing to the water. So we can clear this then, I think now. That's quite cool. Cleaning up Uni Trench's mess. There's stuff in there. Let's, let's get these. We did need coal for some cold. of the upgrade, didn't we? It is dark. Don't we have a we have a flare, don't we?
don't know, I feel like that, that actually makes makes it worse. <laughs> I feel like I can't, can't see anything now. <laughs> I don't know why, I feel like I thought... This will work. I thought, uh, oh, you can see it kind of like tries to grab me in. Um, yeah, I feel like players are going to be more. Oh, no. No, no, no. There we go. The Always be flare up. Wow, it's so dark. You can't can't see anything like it's it's like it's still got the um like the, the filter it. on it let's get rid of these little bits as well then one less pollutants in the sea yeah murky Just like a little shortcut. Yeah, because we can then open that, can't we? Placing mine. For those, there we go. Let's get in there. Okay. Let's have a look at. Uh, Colder. Wait, did this one have oil in the end? No, this one just needed the explosion, didn't it? Put this one out. And there we go. Apart from the story one, uh, the toys in, we actually haven't been to any of the other containers yet. So... I don't know if they're just filled with resources or if they're gonna have like maybe some collectible stuff. Let's have a look. Oh. Or nothing. Oh, you can't open them? Or can you? Oh, but you need to be like standing. Maybe. No. Okay. So they're just on the map because? I'm gonna find this one and see if that's the case as well. I was under the assumption Please to see me. We'd be able to open them and get stuff. Cause they look like a um a collectible. Like like a um like an actual point of interest on the map, don't they? Okay. Here's a blue one. Maybe they're just, it's just letting you know the state of the ocean. Oh no, 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 this one, this one does have a lock. So we can open this one. Okay, so maybe it's just the blue ones. I'm 
Okay. Oh. That squid in there? Pearl Murray. Yeah, a little squid was in, in there. Pearl was my daughter. She is my daughter. She was sunshine. She was a rainbow. She was pure joy encapsulated in the most beautiful little girl the world has ever seen. She is perfection. We got an achievement for saving the squid. <laughs> I do want to follow you, but I've, I, I've got to go back in my... I can hear first. He's waiting though, he's coming back. They lead us to caves, don't they? Normally. I'm just going to see... Come on then. Show us the way. Geo's there. Second Cathedral. Whoa! Ooh. That is my bed. Oh, that's my bed again. Here we go. Tim said he was down here for weeks. Don't know how he managed. Yeah, these octopus are quite, quite helpful, aren't they? Okay. With some plastic. You don't belong in here. Some of that. Let's. And this. Oh, hey. A craft okay, fuel thing. upgrade. Nice. Perfect. Okay. Huh. Electronics. Torrens hollows. These caves are almost ecosystems in themselves. They're a refuge for some species from the currents, predators, or most recently pollution. Find them soothing somehow, like sanctuaries from all the shit. Uni Trench is putting the rest of this area through. Still, can't get too distracted. Many a diver's end has come from swimming unprepared into an unknown cave system. I imagine. Must be quite the risk of, um getting disorientated and getting lost there and then you're on a time limit with your oxygen uh fire at the uni trench main rig when you manage to set the water on fire that's a pretty good indicate you fucked up i don't know what happened on the rig i don't want to know but i know it's a disaster that was bound to happen uni trench have been running this place into the ground zero investment zero oversight something was bound to blow and now it has okay Pearl's teddy lumiere um, I've seen anyone so in love with an inanimate object. I don't know how he got here. I don't think I want to know. Whaling harpoon. These are the ones we found last time. Was the whiskey, mass-produced grog, and the vertebrae, whale bone. Okay. What are these? Oh, oxygen sticks. Grabbing nice. oxygen. Grabbing oxygen. There's some. Oh, just some algae in there. That'll do nicely. Oh, some geodes there as well. I can't remember if we needed more geodes. I think we actually ran out of coal, didn't we? Yeah, we still got we still got a load of geodes. I mean, we'll, we'll take these ones, but I can use this because they're here. I'm not necessarily going out of my way for geodes, though, you know. But okay, so that was a good one. Um, let's try and find that one. Don't want to crash either. I feel like sometimes this thing is almost too responsive, and then I crash it. <laughs> it's like I'm trying to... Um, Counterbalance it. Mm, okay. Still no whale shark as of yet. Yeah, we might want to have a look then and see. Oh, there's a thing there as well. We can get rid of that. 
I don't know if we're meant to be getting rid of all these. Obviously, we've got the laser to do so. Clean up complete. This one is already open. It's like a bike in here. It's chilling. And he doesn't have anything to say about that. He's like, yeah, no, that's... That's cool. Yes, yeah, so the yellow ones. Hello, girl. Yellow ones, uh, you can't interact with, basically. It seems that submarine wreck. There's a sticker in that one. We want to go around and do these while we're here. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Wait, there's one here, but it doesn't show on that. Okay, let's, let's get these quick. Okay. That's cleaned up. There is. That's a red one. Doesn't look like there's something on that. We can. Yeah, no. Can't interrupt with that one either. But we got a blue one, yeah, and the blue one has a charge thingy on it. Okay. So rather than having us, like, kind of go and have to open every single one, you can kind of just open the blue ones. Grab that chunk of metal. What's in here? Anything? Maybe there doesn't need to be anything. Nothing in that one. Let's go. It is point in that one. Waste wasted a mine for that. Get down. Okay. There's a yellow one down there. Oh no, my theory has been debunked. The yellow ones can also have... Okay, so it's just random. The yellow ones can also have... Uh, have a bomb thingy on them. I say it every time, but these aren't whale sharks, are they? What's a whale shark look like? Should I, should I Google it? Like, I don't actually know. Oh, I'm standing right next to mine. Ooh, whoops. Oh, it's kind of like flat and spotty. Um... They're the third biggest creature in the ocean after blue whales and fin whales. Okay, so from the picture they didn't... I wouldn't have guessed they were big, but yeah, they're, they're chunky. And I've got like a flat face. Spotty. Okay. And I've got like a big oval kind of mouth as well. I see why they're called a whale shark, because they're kind of like... Okay, they're kind of like in between Solid and both. useful. So, we're kind of spending charges to open these, and there's nothing actually in them. I feel like... My gamer brain is like, no, I should get rewarded. You know, like that kind of... Hmm. Shiny. I've gone to a map point marker. 
there should be a collectible inside, you know? However, we do have a sticker and we can add it to the tank. What's this one? Oh, like a Cthulhu. <laughs> we will equip. We have all stickers, all these stickers equipped so far, right. So, the whale shark is massive. Like, almost blue whale size. I'm going to check these ones as well. There's, a, there's another yellow one. This one cannot be opened. Acid bottles there. There's a container fell very nicely in here. You have to get out and have a look. I know the oil rig's on fire. I know, but man's processing grief. You know, in his own way. Ah, Some resources. people just want to watch the world burn. He's got collector's algae. Okay, so let's see what we get from these. Fresh green algae, useful. Okay, so we can collect our thing back, and then nothing in here either. Okay. On the one hand, I'm kind of like, if I didn't do these at all, for internal heating systems. I wouldn't have freed the squid, you know? But other than that, most of these have been pretty, pretty barren. He doesn't even really say anything about it. Red one's just covered in oil. I'm getting that one anyway. You'd think like they'd be really like not keen on oil spills. It's all their profits, you know? Cause I mean, even before the big oil spill has happened today. There's still still oil out and about, you know? Okay, I think we've seen them all now. Not such the treasure hunt I thought it might be. We're still missing that one crafting blueprint, which I'm very close to Googling because I don't know how we can figure that out. But in the meantime, we can remove the X. And let's go to the drone control center. Oh. If we see it, we'll, we'll laser it. Shouldn't this be someone else's job? Cleaning up all this pollution? Probably. Probably. But did a good job. This game is too relaxing. Like, oh my god. I feel like at times it's like spa music. Could be. I just, but I'm just very susceptible to like pianos and underwater sounds. Like highly like triggered in a sleepy way. Okay, <laughs> you're looking for maintenance access. Okay. Got it. Central oh. drone control. There's a crafting blueprint over there. Okay. Where'd you come from? 
Where do you come from? Okay. Let's open this door. I guess he's, he's a bit slow opening them, but at the same time, he's like rotating something heavy in water, like grip and everything is probably hard there. Yeah. Hello? Hello? Is someone there? gonna like explode again they keep sending us into like their dodgy facilities which aren't the most well maintained are they to drone storage should be around here. Oh, well, there's no O2 sticks left. I mean, thankfully, I've got some. So that's all good. I'm guessing it's through here then. Is that door? Yeah. this maybe the same for me to pull right now no no we're going for it oh it's the elevator yeah you're breaking up open the main door okay we got it we got it we got it We can open main door. It's fine. We've got loads of oxygen sticks as well. We're comfy. We're safe. Oh, God. Oof. No. Wait, those are those things you didn't like. A dream. No, no, you can't be real. Nah, he's... This is insane. Hallucinating? This can't be. <sighs> God damn it. I mean, it's not the road at least. This stuff is real. If I'm not having some sort of mental breakdown, I have to get past it. Got to find something to push it back. Yeah, and that's not real, is it? Um, transistor, maybe. That thing destroyed these drones. Is it? Natural. I was gonna say, can we go for like a vent? About there's another drone there. We go under it. Some coal. Put a flare. Push him away, maybe? <laughs> you don't like that, do you? Yeah, okay. Okay. Just a little further. Come on. Come on. Oh. Yeah, come on. You can do it. Push through. Another piece of coal. You get that coal, though. Wait, I can't see shit. I can't see shit. Oh, there we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, I was like, I can't actually see anything. <laughs> Need to pick up my flare though. Can't, can't litter, you know. All right, let's take a oxygen stick. So, I mean, this could count as combat a little bit, I guess. Oh, yeah. That'll do it. Kind of. Yes. A light in the dark. Yes. 
was gonna say, I didn't find the flare very useful earlier in the dark, but I guess here it's not too bad. Every, everything's red already, so. Wet coal still burns. So is this like, <sighs> this can't be real, can it? This must be like his, like the metaphor of the light in the dark. Like his, his will and hope. Against his depression. Wait, didn't you just chuck on the floor? You could easily just put it in your pocket. I can repurpose this casing. You can. Oh, little litter bug. What's up here? Oh, some electronics. Whoa. Don't electrocute yourself. Okay, so there's a switch up there. What if we press the switch? Does that do anything? Okay. I'll go through here. Oh, we can go through here as well. I want to get that. Shit, shit, shit. And oh, you got another way in. Oh. Oh, that's just like oh right that's just locked okay i thought he was like an angry because he picked up the the thing i was like dude that's what we do that's what we do Nearly there. okay right under the installation now Interact with this. Jesus. Stan. Shit. God, Tim. You scared the hell out of me. Finally got myself a radio. Wanted to check in. Uh, well, it's. It's a mess. There's been a chemical leak or. or some weird. Leech things found their way inside. Leeches. Stan is. Are you? I'm fine. I'm fine. Look, the surface is a mess. A drill in Sector A broke loose, caused the systemic collapse that sent the rig up like cheap firewood. We need those drones, Stan. I've got your position. Good. You'll buy the release for the secondary exit. Got a problem. The bay doors are shut tight. Looks like something triggered an emergency lockdown. Odd. I'll speak to maintenance, get you a back door. Until then, get that exit open. Right. Exit. Got it. Hmm. Looks like a repair platform. Is this going to turn? Hang on. Anything? Must be something I missed. Uh -oh. Okay, do we have enough batteries? We do not. We have one battery. Let's find some more batteries. <laughs> Let's, um, maybe under here. There'll be some more. And then presumably once we've got all three batteries we can press the switch. Oh. Oh, 
Oh, this is not a door. This is batteries. I need batteries. Yeah, this is where we want to send the power, isn't it? Okay. We should do the trick. It's deep down here, isn't it? Oh, there's a crafting table. Well, that's nice of them. Oh, there's two batteries here anyway. Oh, there's no power there for the crafting table. Okay. Well, everything... We've got all the batteries now, so that should be fine. Pop that one in. And that one in. Should be able to open the bay doors now. So what's the choice of this? We can have it go to the drone control command. To these. So that powers the crafting table. No idea what that powers. I'm guessing we want to move this. So it powers the doors. That would make the most sense. Some won't budge. Good. Now, reactivate as many of the buggers as you can. Right. Drone online. Okay. I'm just going to turn these all on. down to this one. I need an oxygen stick. Again, a bit low. Spamming B to pick up this man's litter. Activated. Go get him. There's one above, wasn't there? Oh. There is. Yeah, blue lights. I mean, there's a drone. Okay. Oh, we got a lot to turn on. Oh, okay. as well yep there he is get him as well last one one over here yes it says find an exit for the drones do they know where they could go How many of my men to turn on? All of them. Okay. 
Okay, we got one and two. It's really making me work, isn't it? I guess though we want want as many of these drones on, don't we? And I guess we will find the exit. We started on that wall, didn't we? So I think it's just this wall. Yeah, it's just this wall left. So there's just seven left. Oh, got some electronics there. It'd be really useful if there's like a switch that we could just press and they'd all turn on. That'd be handy. Oh, above. Kind of like little bees, aren't they? Like little work bees. They're kind of small and yellow as well. Because these are kind of like a little honeycomb, aren't they? Like a little honeycomb hive. Oops, doing little loop the loops. There we go. <laughs> So that's that one. This one here as well. Another electronic part. Like I said, not too sure how much more crafting stuff we'll need. We do still have a few upgrades to buy those, so. Still kind of picking stuff up because like I said we did run out of coal earlier, so but I think we got a lot of the other kind of stuff at the moment, which is quite nice. Oh, I've already done this one. There's no drone here. Is this where I started then? Oh, it didn't go below me. Okay. I did that one. Okay. So I think I've done the others. Yeah, I've done that one. Oh, I haven't done. Oh, I haven't done these two. Maybe this is before I realised that I need to do them all. Wait, I still even don't actually even know if I have to do them all. We just have to find an exit. But. I was hoping like I'd do enough and then and then it'd be like, oh like the drones are going this way. <laughs> okay. We should take another oxygen stick. What do we get that for? Pick up ten empty oxygen sticks. Little achievement there. So that one's done. This one's not done. Okay. I think mean, I didn't realize how high it went up. So I've done all of these ones. No, I haven't. No. Are they respawning? No, I've done that one. Oh, I just did the lower ones. Oh, there's so many. Yeah, okay, I did these. That one. Did that one. Okay. Yeah, I didn't know it went up that high, I think. Okay, so these should be the last ones, because those ones are done. Okay. Okay, missed these guys originally. They need to, like, have some more, like, maintenance engineers or something, because everything's breaking <laughs> down here. It's, like, probably costs them more in the long run. I would have thought. A bunch of electronics. Turn that on. 
Oh, did legs at the gym today. Um, my legs are really aching. Look at that. That's unusual behavior. Um, but no, that's why I'm moving around a lot, because I'm like, I'm comfortable. <laughs> we go. Yeah, I can't sit still for some reason. I'm just like, all tight. Right, I think we have done these ones. Yeah, we've done these ones. That's all good. Okay. So, is there like a roof? Like, up here? Like, can we... Oh, no. Oh, it, oh, it looked like it. <laughs> Come on, that looked like there was like a little hole we could swim through there. And then and then the textures were just like came into view in the fog. Okay. What does the tanks do? Because there's a few power things. What um what options do we have? So we've got the drones. We've got all the drones just spinning around being absolutely useless, not gonna lie. I think that's where I came from. Oh no, my ship's parked in this way. Yeah, there's an emergency exit. Okay. This is the way. Probably just need to... Oh. I can't interact with... Oh, there's another drone. Maybe we haven't unlocked all the drones yet. Oh, there's another drone over there. Are you kidding me? How am I missing all these? Alright, there's one there. There's no more here, is there? I'm guessing... Oh, there's one there as well. Okay, let's get him. I am very bad at this, aren't I? <laughs> Guessing once we've woken up these two drones, it'll be like, right, okay. They can help us open the door or something. Yeah, I'm... Uh... Okay, I'm gonna have to go to the middle. And then just do a little look. Right. These are all all empty. That one's empty. Yeah, that one's empty. Yeah. Got them all in front of their little doors. So, one down there. No, yeah, he's done as well. One's down here, are happy too. One's down here, are happy. Okay, I think I've actually woken them all up. If that wasn't the puzzle solution. How do we open this door? Okay, maybe it's one of these power things. Maybe like moving it to the um to these these little we're gonna move it around okay that powers crafting station which i guess they had to put in just because if you've uh, 
guess you could actually fail here, couldn't you? If you didn't collect enough stuff. Maybe this is right. If you didn't collect enough stuff. Then. No, it's still red. Still not on. Um, and you couldn't make the the oxygen sticks. Would, would that be game over? It's still red as well. I feel like this is a super simple solution. And I'm overthinking it. I can see my my thing here. My I'm right above my or below the moon. Can't open this. Can't even interact with it. I guess if it's not up. Maybe it's down. Maybe we need to go. Down. Wait, 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 wait. What's this? What's this? Is this a switch? This is a switch. Yep. Yep. Okay. Swim, buddy. Swim. Okay, I've got to spin it all the way around again. I need to put it to the north. The north-facing one. 12 o'clock. On the clock. Wish you could, like, turn it counterclockwise. Gotta be it. It's gotta be it. I was a bit slow on that one, guys. Not gonna lie. Should have just looked around first. All right. Second okay. exit open. Easy. Oh, so I found the exit. It just took me so long to find out the. Uh... Tracking the fleet now. Well done, lad. Oh, oh I. Well, oh, I got them all, didn't I? Whatever it is that's going on over in Sector B. But that's nothing for you to worry about. You've done more than enough already. All green. Yes, yes, I'm on my way. Stan, got a crisis team meeting. <gasps> There's one left. There we'll talk in a few. No. Hmm. With pleasure. I still managed to miss one. Go, little buddy. Be with your friends. actually helped that it there's another one down there as well how did i still manage to miss a couple this might be useful oh he's not going now yeah they should have done that anyway like they should have gone green when it wait 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 wait. i have done this one this one's not 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 green just want to say blue. Okay. Well, we can... Yeah, we can go, can't we? Where's the exit? There we go. Right. Let's, uh... Let's get out of here. Getting the hell out of here. Yeah. This place feels wrong. Stan, we've got the drone signals coming through loud and clear. Well done, well done indeed. We'll send them out to fight the fire. Hold down the fort while we try and get everything under control. What then? Hmm? What then? What happens to Unitrench? Unitrench will never news gets a hold of this, they'll be held to pay, surely. News won't get hold of this. I don't know, Stan, honestly. We're in uncharted territory. 
You should see the state of things up here. It's awful. Yeah. Yeah. I imagine it is. Anyway. Not over yet. Anyway. We really need you at Sector A, Stan. Get those drills offline. Roger. It's like the Jeremy Clarkson meme, isn't it? Oh no. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> Big corporate. Okay, run that. Oh, one second. Back up. Say hello to Hugo. Come on. Um. Okay, so there was actually two crafting blueprints we want to get first. Since you know, the corporate is burning either way. So and they've they've. Done well holding on so far. So we're gonna go grab this blueprint. Which I'm guessing is down there. Still no whale shark yet. I have been to most places so far. That car. I how does a car get down here though? Same with the van that we saw in the other episode, like... How's that happen? Because... Even if someone was to like, drive the car into the water... It wouldn't travel this far, would it? It would just sink straight away, right? So much trash. Almost got a hundred metal. You can always put metal to use. Oh, I skipped his little comment about the car. I think he was also wondering how it, how it got here from what I briefly saw at the subtitles. Just, just sprinkle these around the ocean. Decoration four. Okay. <clears throat> okay, that's cool. Um, there's a, another helicopter up here. This is like the Bermuda Triangle of like wreckages, isn't it? Well, apparently that's a myth. Apparently, there's not some. Uh... Like I was always under the impression it was like a an area where if you flew over it, like it's magnetism or something, right? And, uh, planes would. All or the uh, the boats would get lost. But apparently, this place. I think it was kind of became like water. more of an urban legend or a myth or something. Like some people have gone missing, but not enough, I guess. Coincidence. Well, that's what they want us to think. Right. It's just like a cooler helicopter. Interact with it first. Bad land. <laughs> Can't park there, mate. <laughs> That's basically what he's saying there. Can't park there. These are normal basic bit sharks. These the aren't. To dredge these up. Stop them polluting the area. Heavy. Oh, here we go. What's that? A snow globe. Snow globe. Nineteen sixty-nine. Christmas, nineteen sixty-nine. Been out here a while. I guess technically it's only what eight years. I think this game's set in nineteen seventy-seven. So, so I use the Steam page descriptions for um bit of info about the game oh in the um in my descriptions on these videos but um yes yeah, so it was only when i was actually uploading them to youtube that i was like ah that settles the the time the time frame debate that i was having shouldn't this be someone else's job so i was like it looks old but modern and it is like a, an alternate an alternate reality my technology advanced
Okay, we can probably just head to sector. Let's get rid of the marker. Head to sector A. What is this like? Uh, we're actually really near the surface. Oh, so that's the actual rig itself. Okay. It's going to go swim under the the building through like the access. Some drones helping out. There's some more drones. Okay. Yeah. So can we open this now? All right. Got you coming up on sector A entrance. We need to authorize Moon's docking rights. Okay. Done. Nice. Oh. We should let you in. Arms are down for this whole section of the grid. Flying solo from here. Find the drills. Activate manual shutdown. That's it. Good luck. Okay. You can turn on eco mode from the graphics menu to reduce your power consumption. That's cool. I don't think my 1200 watt PSU and my 4090 are that eco friendly though. Regardless, but that's a cool touch. Something's wrong. I know all of this. Maybe I. I shouldn't be down here. Unbelievable. The state of this place is just. It's kind of like, oh, it is like a like we're inside the thing on it. Okay, it's got north drill, south drill, main drill. So disable the main drilling unit for now. What the hell did they do to this place? The manual shutoff should be in the sector control station. That's my first stop. They've just like created a whole crater. Drilling right into the bedrock. Broken pipes. I'm imagining we're gonna have to um sector control. Go to the auxiliary ones first. Oh, there is some. There's a wreck in here and some chests. Okay, so some bits to explore here too. Wait, can we park? No. I guess there's no real. Oh, there we go. There we go. 
I finally registered it. <laughs> I was like, just gonna get out. Okay. Get some fuel. Some of that, so... Okay. Okay, so we want to laser that actually, and then go inside. <clears throat> little weird little oil tentacles. Oh, covering the door there. Right. Okay. Listen. This way. Why is why is Pearl speaking up? I can't lose his mind down here. Like we need north and south, don't we? Ah, oh, damn. Pressure's too high. Need to get it down. Disable north and south. Yeah, okay. Okay, I should go in here, though. Tim said all the oil in the area is routed through this facility. We need to reduce the flow in those pipes, which both cables are linked to the drills outside. We. Oh, okay, we don't have to go to them. Glad to check these rooms before running off to go to the map for north and south. <laughs> oh. Yeah, the game gives you everything you need. So if you if you're not someone who's like cares about the ex exploration or crafting. Um, I don't think you need to worry too much. You can pretty much. The game gives you everything you need on a platter. I'll just to play this as quite a should be purely story experience. Control. Imagine if you're playing it like that. It's probably only. Um... Back. Get back. Okay. Yeah, it's probably only a three, four, a three, four hour game. Right. So does that work now? Site deactivated. That should stop the flow. Okay. Nice. Another flare. Get the rest of the drilling stopped and get out. There we go. Try and get him to like grab it then. 
Out of no, no, get out of my head. Probably the pressure as well, right? Like, look how big the drill is. No, 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 no. Right, do you get altitude sickness at a negative level? You, get, you can get the bends, right, in water. Come up too quick, right? their checks mate like <laughs> it's acting like you didn't know unitrencher in the uh, in the oil business i guess at the time they gave him that what he needed getting away from it all i feel like coming to terms with that. He's probably thinking now, actually. Don't... Oh, pick up some more mines, because, yeah, we are going to need some more. Um, he's probably thinking now, actually. Shouldn't really be supporting them. Stick. Yeah, pick the stick up. Yeah, pick our metal up. Oh, oh those creatures. God. Dead a thousand years. The lifeblood of the planet. Judged up for what? There are cars and plastic, I guess. I always wondered how they did it, really. I didn't really know. I imagine it was like a big drill, and they just... What if they're angry? Drill down. It's like a little pump, isn't what it, as well? What is angry? It has every right to fight back. the surface you can just hand in his nose can he and be there for his wife and for his wife to be there for him and 
first sister grief. Cause yeah, I'd, I'd be like, I'd be wanting a lot of money for what we're doing right now. <laughs> He's all on his own down here, sorting all their problems out. That's enough. That's enough. I've done my part. I need to. I need to leave now. Yeah. Oh, we're in the right way? Yeah. No collectibles down there, is there? No. I haven't mean, I mean, done well there. I think he's, um, I'll be like, no. A mm, little bit of extra bonus. I'll be on my way. Thank you. And go, go back to the surface. Say, I don't really need the elevator, I just swim up, but you can't actually. It's probably a loading screen. Like, loading screen hidden behind. And the elevator. stuff there. Got a loot. I actually got Timothy. End of year evaluation for Timothy Graham dated the 4th of May 1964. Timothy joined us after several years of vehement opposition to Uni Trench's presence in the region. In fact, he was rapidly identified by the company as a ringleader of local unrest. During one protest at the Shorehaven site, he struck Name Redacted with a slogan banner. Name Redacted suffered a concussion and was met to local hospital for several days. No charges were filed. After a change of heart, Timothy took quickly to our diver training initiative and became one of our finest exploratory team leaders. Late last year, he was chosen to lead the primary sortie into the area known locally as the Deeps, the result of which has opened up several new research paths that promise to change the face of the entire organization. It's therefore the opinion of this reviewer that Timothy Graham be promoted to dive supervisor effective immediately. So how do you like go from being the ringleader of the opposition to just being full on on board with, with Unitrench, you know? How does that, how does that happen? How do we get to that point? Right, well, we are going to check out the charter plane first. Come on. Let's get back. That's the plane. <laughs> it's funny, you know. Well, the jellyfish. I'm talking to you like you're a living, breathing creature. Like you understand me <laughs> but you're not you don't you're a submarine a machine 
Can you give something a name? Moon. Mercury. You give it a face. Those jellyfish. Look. They're just floating nervous systems. Are they conscious? Alive? Not in any way I can understand. So, how are you different to them? Really? All right, mate. I have to be going in on moon. Companions. It's the loneliness. The fear of loneliness. Desperation. Ugh. I came down here to be alone, but I've turned you into a constant companion. It's true. What does that say about me? Hmm? No, I talk to an animal object. Well, those voices the talk same. to myself. Loneliness. Manifested. Pearl. My own mind. Fighting against itself. <sighs> Listen to me. Talking nonsense. I'm tired. Need sleep. Yeah, he's getting a bit rattled. Come on, friend. Let's get back. Yeah, I mean, I thought it was a like an only child thing when you brought up pretty much with no brothers or sisters. Um. Yeah, you like talk to yourself. Do people not do that? This. Yeah. Whoops. Look up here. There we go. I knew the chest was here somewhere. Over a hundred crafting materials. We're going to spend it when we get back. So we got some new crafting blueprints and stuff. So that's good. I really made a comment about the child plane. Electronics. I mean, this ain't really a charter plane, is it? Chart planes are like private jets, right? It's a full on massive plane. Don't know. It's probably not a 747 in the 70s. But it's huge, isn't it? Big plane. The jellyfish are cool. I'm just curious if the tiger, if the, not the tiger shark, the whale shark would be in here. Can't um can't really see him. But what we're gonna do is I'm gonna break this up into a second episode because we're running at almost an hour and forty minutes now. And I don't want this risking going over into like two, two and a half hours. So for the first time in this series, we're not going to end it at the end of the day. We're going to end it right here. And... I can leave it like that. Um, yeah, we're, we're going to leave it there for now. And I will catch you in the next episode for part five. So make sure you subscribe for that. Remember to leave a like and comment on the video as well. It really helps the algorithm. Really appreciate it. And yeah, thank you for watching. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care.